So in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to change your DNS server in an AIR router. So what you want to do is type in this IP address here, which is 192.168.1.254 and hit enter and it will take you to AIR's uh, login page for the F2000 modem. Once you're on this login page you want to find your Wi-Fi password, uh, which can be located on the back of the router. Uh, once you find that password you want to put it in here. Once you have it in, you want to then log in. And then once you're logged in, it'll take you to this home page. Then you want to go to internet up the top. And it'll take you to the internet settings tab. Stay in this tab, you don't need to go out of it. Then you want to go down to VDSL WAN 1. And you want to click edit. Once you're in edit, you want to scroll down until you see static DNS, which is here. This will be unticked when you see it, but you just tick that and it will show these boxes here. These will have different numbers here where the 8.8.8 .8 is. You can take them out and replace it with 8.8.8.8 .8 for the first one. And then for the second one you want to replace it with 8.8.4.4. .8 Once you have that done then you need to save your settings. It'll submit and then it'll take you back and they're saved. And you can see here then in the primary and secondary DNS servers they have changed. Uh, what this does is it takes the DNS servers that you were on originally, which were Ayers, original DNS servers, and you're changing them now so you're actually on Google's DNS servers instead. So once that's done, that should fix your problem with the Air out Wi-Fi, and you should be able to connect again, and that should fix everything. You don't need to change these numbers again, you can keep them like that, and it's not going to make a difference even when the DNS servers come back online. So. That should fix the problem.